and welcome to another installment of Painting with Animals with your host, Auguste Bertillon. Good afternoon and uh, welcome to another installment of Painting with Animals. And I am your host, Auguste Bertillon. <laughs> uh, you may recall last week I showed you how to paint this a uh, duck. And a very nice duck it was too, very good duck. And the week before that, I showed you how to paint this a uh, bat. Uh, I don't think the bat uh, was feeling too well that week. But no matter. This week, today, I'll show you something different for a change, and I'll show you how to paint this a rat. Hello, my little friend, huh? Now, then, it doesn't uh, really matter where you uh, may get your rat from. Uh, you may uh, catch a rat running down your legs while you're trying to sleep in your bed, maybe, if you uh, live in a place like I do. Or uh, maybe you have to go to the pet store and get a rat. Uh, it really does not matter. Uh, because, well, a rat is a rat is a rat. <laughs> so, anyway, another thing you might keep in the mind, uh, come to think of it, is uh, that uh, when you are painting this an animal, uh, you don't really want to tell your neighbors what you are doing because, uh, well, some people become very upset at the idea of painting this an animal, uh, especially if it is uh, this, uh, their pet doggy or one of their small children. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> so, never mind. Anyway, so, which one of you little things wants to be a famous artist today, huh? You tell August. To your August, I think maybe you, I make maybe you want to be, ooh, your house stinks in there. <laughs> so, anyway, we take the little rat here, and the first thing you want to do is to grasp the rat firmly by the scruff of the neck. You don't want the little murderer to bite the fingers, no? No. So, you grasp the rat like this. Another thing you want to keep in mind when you are painting with an animal, and that is that you are pretty much restricted to the abstract art form only. Uh, well, I mean, can you imagine the great Leonardo trying to paint the Mona Lisa with a rat? No, of course not. Don't be silly. <laughs> we even need something uh, much smaller, something like a fly or something, and it's impossible. So. I'll show you today how to paint this the rat. Um, sometimes, before you start to paint with the animal, you like to psych him up and get him really fierce for the action, like this. Hey, you, little rat, you listen to me, eh? You listen to August, eh? You want to be a great little artist, eh? Okay, today, eh? See, we got him all psyched up now, eh? You're ready? Okay, so, be ready to start now? We take the rat and we zip the pen into the paint like this, very carefully. Here you go, my little friend. And then we attack the canvas like this. Oh, yes, my little friend. Ooh, ponte, petit monstre, ponte. That's very nice. You did very good work for the first time, uh -huh, no? So now we try another color, maybe some yellow, dip the tail into the yellow. You'll find your nose know, when you paint this rat. The tail gives some very nice effects, especially if you start to swing the animal like this. Oh, that looks very nice, my little thing. You're doing very good. Uh, we try another paint here and see. Maybe we get a little more ferocious, my friend. Huh? Ah, ah, here, petit pont des monstres. Oh, very good, very good, my friend. Oh, 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 fantastic. Very good, my friend. Now be still, you little bugger. Now look at this great work here. Looks very nice, very nice. You do very good work. I am very impressed. Wasn't that fun, friends? Huh? So one thing you want to keep in mind now, and once you are finished with painting with the animal. You want to rinse him out very good. Wash out your rat, just like you was washing out the paintbrush. That's right. Oh, very good, very good. Get him nice and clean, just like a little bat. Eh? So, <laughs> so now then, that is how we paint this the rat. And oh, we ship you off here. Ah, very good. Au revoir, my little friend, my petit artist. <laughs> so, 
That is how we paint with a rat. Don't you wish it you'd been a famous artist today, huh? Like August. So, until next week, you come back. Oh, next week you come back, I'll show you how to paint with a boa constrictor, huh? Should be very good. So, until next week, this is August Bertillon bidding you au revoir. <laughs> This has been another installment of Painting with Animals with your host, Auguste Bottillon. Letters of protest may be sent to Post Office Box 42A, Pelvis, New Mexico, 87001. This has been a Desmond Ear production. Thank you.